Okay, we are ready to start on day two. Um, the mini is still clean from yesterday. I wiped off all the dew because uh, I had to sit outside last night. Um, so today, uh, our first step is going to be putting on some, uh, I don't know if you can read that or not, but uh, Poor Boy's uh, EX sealant with Carnuba, so wax. Uh, this is just going to provide uh, protection for the paint. Um, so this is why I have uh, everything taped off from yesterday, or most of it taped off. There's a few things like the trim around the sunroof that I'll deal with cleaning it later. What what wax gets on the, the rubber, um, it's going to be too hard to try to tape it off. But uh, so the poor boys will be using a blue pad, um, no cutting to it, it's just for spreading wax. Um, they do provide uh, both hand and machine instructions, but basically uh, going to use the, the porter cable to spread the wax on, uh, let it dry to a light haze uh, like you typically do with a wax and then buff it off by hand uh, using a microfiber towel. Um, so uh, a little bit different than yesterday. It does say it can be used in the sun or shade. I'm going to be doing it in the garage again in the shade. It's still real cool out anyway this morning. Um, we'll go ahead and lay this down, hopefully get this knocked out and then start work on some of the other little things I need to take care of, like this black trim. Okay, just thought I would show um, the application of the wax here with the uh, polisher. Yeah, just put a little bit on there. You see how it just dripped off right there, but just kind of pat it on and get it going. I have not yet gotten to the point where I've started buffing any off. I've done everything over the belt line roof and all the windows and everything, uh, but I'm still letting it dry. Oh, it looks like it's kind of hazy. Uh, the nice thing about using this quarter cable is that it helps spread it on really, really thin and that you don't need much, which should help make it a lot easier to buff off then. In the past, when I did it by hand, it was always so thick. And I couldn't get it uh, to come off real easily. Okay, I'm trying to show you. It might be a little hard, but you can tell the wax is hazed here on the hood. I already finished everything over the belt line again, but um, down here on the red, I thought I would show you. So, just gonna wipe it off. And as I have discovered, this is about the easiest job to wipe this off now. Again, because with the polish shirt help get it on just, just enough to be effective and not enough to where I'm having to work to get everything off. I mean, I'm barely using any pressure with my towel here, and it is just, it's just coming right off. Very nice, and it looks great.